channel. Today I am going to share with you my current beauty favorites. I find, I don't know about you guys, but as I'm getting a little bit older, I'm making different choices. I think, feel like I'm making more practical choices when it comes to beauty products. I'm not one for wearing lots of makeup. I do like to have a little bit of a glow, but I don't put heavy makeup on whatsoever. But I have found that my skin has changed, my hair has changed, and I guess this comes with after having two children, working in a city, just being stressed out a lot of the time. I find that I'm making different choices to try and suit products that fit with me better. So I thought what I would do is gather some of them together, which I've done in my trustworthy little bag, and I'm gonna share with you, and I'll also link everything down below in case you're interested in purchasing some of them, what I use pretty much on a daily basis and what my current favorites are. So I'm gonna start first with my Clinique. This is the Deep Comfort, the Body Butter. This is a little bit on the pricey end. It was a gift, I have to be honest, but I absolutely love this. I will use this normally after I have a bath, so it's kind of like an exfoliating cream. I really, really enjoy it. It is a huge container, it's 200 bills, and yeah, I've had it since, I've had it since Christmas, I think. Yeah, since just before Christmas. And I'm really pleased with it. It also smells delicious, but as you can see, had it just before Christmas and there's still so much left inside of it. So that is the Clinique Deep Comfort Body Butter. And I use this, I'd say probably about twice a week. So moving on, um, going with that, this is on the other end of the spectrum price-wise. I absolutely love my Garnier Body Summer, what is this, Summer Body, and I have this in the, I think it's the medium tone. It's got an apricot smell. I find this self-tanning lotion does not streak whatsoever. I really like Garnier products, and you can get it for three pounds at Wilco's or Boots or anything. I mean, I go through this stuff like water. I tend to use self-tan, um, almost every day, if I'm being honest. But um, I don't like using tanning machines and doing that kind of stuff. I prefer to do it myself. So I have this on stock always, and it's always on special at Boots or Wilco's or Superdrug or something like that. So this is something that I use, I would say, on a daily basis. Moving on, um, my perfume. So the perfume that I'm currently using at the moment is Daisy by Marc Jacobs. And this is just a tiny little one. I actually bought this. Um, I bought this twice last year, both times when I went to Greece. And I bought it both times on the flight. So it's a really small one. I think this is a 50 mils, but it smells so lovely. I absolutely love this smell. I used to, I'm trying to, yeah, it's got this, it just stays on. You know when you get those perfumes and they'll be so expensive and they just, they go by lunchtime. I feel like this stays on throughout the day. It's also such a cute little container. I mean, you can't go wrong with a little flower. Um, But I think I'll continue to use Daisy Love. I absolutely love it. In fact, I love anything by Marc Jacobs. I think they smell so lovely. So that I got. Can't remember how much it retailed for. I think it was probably about... I'd like to say about 42 pounds along there. So a bit pricey for such a small thing, but it lasts. This has lasted me um, since last October. So it's still going strong. Then moving on, what shall I choose next? Um, I'll talk about hair care products actually. Um, so I'm in the midst of growing my hair out. Now my hair is very, very fine. And I find the older I get, the thinner it's getting. And I decided this year, um, something I was gonna do was I was gonna treat myself to a really nice haircut. And my hairdresser, I absolutely love her and she did a fabulous job. And I also was gonna treat myself to all new hair care products. I knew it was going to be pricey but I also knew they would last and they would build up my hair again. And I got my hair done, I think a month ago and I can already feel, I mean, it feels really soft today cause I've just washed it, but I can feel it getting stronger. I know that it's growing compared to when I would just buy sort of like quick, easy shampoos. Um, so the products that I use in my hair because I do straighten my hair a lot. Um, and my hairdresser explained that I was pulling a lot of force, like when I was bringing my hair forward and doing it. That's why the back of my hair was a lot healthier compared to the front of my hair. But these products I found have been really, really good, um, especially if you have really thin hair. 
They are a bit pricey, but completely worth it. So the spray that I use is the GHD, the Heat Protect Spray. I think it retails at about 23 pounds. You literally need the tiniest bit. And the best thing about this stuff is that not only can you do it on your wet hair, but the next day, if you don't want to wash your hair and you just put a bit of dry shampoo in, then you can just chuck this on as well. And it doesn't have that like gunky pulley feel at all. It's just really good. It just, um, you, you'd never knew you had product in it. And I absolutely love it. Um, highly recommend the GHD spray. I think you can also get it on Amazon and stuff, but I'm sure local hairdressers have it too. And then something I use um, to strengthen my hair a bit is this new, um, it's this new product I found actually, and it's um, called Label. And I use their shampoo and conditioner at the moment now. I'm actually gonna share that in a different video. But yeah, it's called Label.M, that's right. And this is the Therapy Rejuvenating Protein Cream. It's 50 mils. It retails, I think, at 18 pounds. But you guys, it, this stuff is so good. Again, you can use it when you have wet hair and when you have dry hair. And it's just amazing in the sense that it doesn't feel gunky like the other stuff, but you can literally feel like, you know, at the end, sometimes your hair feels brittle and frail and stuff. It doesn't at all. It just strengthens it. And just using a tiny little bit every day, I find is really helping. So these two products, a bit pricey, but really, really pleased with both of them. And they are daily products that I use. And um, moving on down on the other end of the spectrum again um this is my foundation now i've been using this foundation from super drug um it's from their collection you know how boots has i can't remember what the boots one's called but super drug has their own brand called collection and i absolutely love it um i think it was about six pounds i've used lots of different kinds of foundation ranging from chanel to you know your very basic one at wilco's and i absolutely love this for the price it is amazing and it doesn't cake on um i can put it on in the morning and sometimes i will adjust my makeup or fix it and stuff at lunchtime at work but i really don't have to with this now i do pair this with my bobby brown brush which these are a bit on the steep end um i was fortunate enough to get a set of these as a gift um, but I do it, I just put a little squirt onto here on the brush, you can see right there on the tip, and then just apply it all over my face. And um, yeah, just really pleased. I really like this. Not sure if I'll purchase it again. I do like to change it up when it comes to my makeup, um, but I can highly recommend getting stuff from the collection at Superdrug. Then moving on, um, my night cream. Now I got this in a birch box. Um, so it's not the regular, it's like a sample sale, um, sample size, but I am actually going to go online and purchase the real one because I absolutely love this stuff. Now I can't pronounce the company. Um, it's French and it's Polar, I think, but, um, it's a night cream. It is so good. You need the tiniest little bit. And it just feels so, you know, when you put a primer on how silky and smooth it feels, that's what this cream feels like. It actually makes me like want to get into bed and put my night cream on, as sad as that sounds. Um, but I absolutely love it. So this is it. Again, I'll link everything down below in case you guys are interested in purchasing any of this stuff. You can get this off the Birchbox site. Um, if I remember to, I will also link my code for Birchbox because I do get a subscription, which will enable you guys to get 10% off. Um, this is not an ad, by the way. This is just me saying if you want 10% off, go for it. Um, but yeah, I absolutely love this stuff, Polar Night. And um, it's been great. I love it. Hopefully my dark circles are going away. We'll see. <laughs> Um, and then again, sticking with the whole nighttime thing, again, this was another thing from Birchbox, and this is the Dr. Botanicals, and it's a pomegranate superfood mask. So it's really tiny, um, and basically what you do is you use it two to three times a week, and you actually put it on after you've washed your face, brushed your teeth and everything, you're ready for bed, and you put a little thin layer, and you let it sit overnight, and it just kind of dissolves into your skin. It's just full of microbiotics, full of vitamins. It's amazing. And you wake up, and your skin feels really, really soft. You know sometimes when you wake up, and it feels quite tight if you've done a night mask. My skin felt absolutely great after this. I love using this. I actually just keep it in my bedside drawer, and then I will sometimes um, use it maybe twice, maybe three times um, during the week. So again, 
Dr. Botanical, Dr. Botanicals, I'm having difficulty speaking today. Dr. Botanicals, it's about 50 mils and you can get it off the Birchbox site or I'm sure you can go online and purchase it directly from them too. And then last but not least, this is probably my favorite, favorite beauty product at the moment. Um, for Christmas, I got a little white company set um, by James's auntie and she just, she is so thoughtful. Like she gives the best presents and she's just so lovely. And she gave me this little um, like hand cream set, but then it also had a, a lip balm, which is like lip gloss. I'm actually wearing it right now. And it's from the white company. It is... 15 mils. It's their original lip balm. I actually don't know how much it costs. I'm guessing it's pricey because the white company is pricey, but this stuff is amazing. And I am switched. You guys, I am never going back to using anything else other than this. This is going to be my expensive purchase. that I'm always going to have to do. I absolutely love this lip balm. I carry it around with me everywhere. I'm very tempted to buy another one so that I can take one to work and have one at home. But, um, yeah, I absolutely love it. And I will definitely be repurchasing this. So you guys, those are my current beauty favorites. I'm thinking about doing more current favorites. Um, I always used to love doing these, whether it was like my January favorites or my favorite things I was reading or my favorite things I was watching. Um, so let me know, comment down below if you guys would be interested in me doing more favorite videos. Hope you guys are all having a wonderful day. If you haven't done so already, please join our Through Mummy's Eyes community and hit the red subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up so I know that you guys want more videos like this. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye, everyone.